My name's Mark Boothroyd. I'm a staff nurse at St. Thomas Hospital in elderly care. Um, I'm a member of Unite. We're on strike in protest at the government's re removal of the 1% pay offer um, the, for the NHS this year. We've got, um, most NHS staff have got 0% pay rise, and this is at a time when Parliament are giving themselves 11%. I want Unite to, to call more action and keep up the pressure in the run-up to the general election. You know, we keep striking, keep fighting, we can get, we can get, we can win more pay. But this isn't just about pay, it's about the future of the NHS, about, it's about the, all the privatisation and cuts. The Tories are trying to dismantle the NHS, they're trying to tear it to pieces. We need to take up that and make that central. Because if the NHS is privatised, even if we win decent pay, it's going to be worse service for everyone. Services are going to be rationed, patients aren't going to get good care, and it's not going to be the NHS that you know we've known for the last 60 years. How have the cuts affected you in your particular yeah. job, Mark? Well, we have a huge problem discharging patients out into the community now. Um, there's real pressure on getting... I'm in, a, I'm in a, a nurse in elderly care, so we're dealing with extremely vulnerable patients with complex needs. Uh, social care in the community has been slashed. Patients can be stuck for, for weeks on our wards while while they wait for you know uh, enough funding for nursing homes or to, for, to put packages of care in place. There's huge pressure on beds. We're running at uh, uh, over 100% capacity. You discharge patients in the morning. You've got more patients in the in the by the afternoon. There's no rest. It's very it's very heavy work. I just wanted to say a huge big thank you for all of you to take this action and be out here on this miserable morning but making clear that the message of decent men and women working within the jewel of our civilization send a message not only to this government but to the political elite that we're not prepared to stand anymore for our NHS workers to be treated like second-class citizens. It, it is an outrage that every politician you talk to says how proud they are of our NHS. Of course, in terms of the Tories, we know that to be a lie as they sell off our NHS every single day before our very eyes. And we need to take that message to the whole of this nation of ours so that people can react and say, not in our name. 70% of those uh, services that have been tendered so far have gone into private hands. And we need to make certain that we continue this fight to save our NHS. Now, will this government listen? Well, probably not, although they themselves have said this morning that their reorganisation has been an absolute shambles. Well, you told them that before they even started it. And the reality is this, until such times as political parties and governments start to listen to the people who actually work in the National Health Service, the people who are the experts in knowing how to run a good service, reducing waste, and making certain that money is spent where it's needed, at the point of need. Until such times as that happens, we're going to have to continue to make our voice heard. We hope, of course, that this government will listen, but we doubt it very much. But we want to send also a very clear message to our Labour Party that if they get back elected, if they get elected in May next year, then they need to start dealing with the NHS with one word. NHS workers demands respect, demands proper decent pay rises, proper working conditions and money invested in our NHS. The mood is good. It's really great to see all the unions here together. We've got the Royal College of Midwives, Unison, uh, Unite. GMB, UCAT, all on strike together. This unity is fantastic, shows the solidarity amongst NHS workers and amongst the unions. We should keep it going. We want more action uh, until, this go until this government gives us the, the pay we deserve. What do we want? Fair pay! When do we want it? Now! What do we want? Fair pay! When do we want it? Now! What do we want? Fair pay! When do we want it? Now! What do we want? Fair pay!